Greetings from the ride. Today we're on the road and we're heading out to a Facebook marketplace pickup from a guy that's about 20, 30 miles down the road, but he has a lot of uh, older vintage Matchbox and Hot Wheels. But the main thing I was looking for was the monster trucks that he have, the Matchbox monster trucks that I'm currently collecting and trying to get them all. And uh, then next thing I know, I looked on some other things that he had and I said, why not bring these two? So I screenshotted all the other cars and stuff that I wanted from him. They, and he also had some Ertl Batmobiles from 1989 that I'm really looking forward to go ahead picking up too. So let's get at it. Let's get down the road and see what this guy's right. got. <laughs> all right. All right. I got a whole bunch of stuff, man. That's cool. Yeah, you don't see the, I collect, trade, yeah, sell, man. go to cons. I do all, all kinds good, of stuff. Man. Do my videos. People like to see you go out and find stuff, and Heck especially yeah. this old stuff, you know, like this. Yeah, and these are here. These are a little bit older too. That's really cool. I haven't never seen that one out in the world or this yeah, man, one. We got all kinds of stuff like toys, man. I'm just helping a family I've known for a long time, man. I've oh, had yeah? some deaths and stuff, and I told okay. them I put some things online for them and stuff like that. They got my own garage just full of like all types of everything. That's sweet. That's nice. These are really cool, too. They're my yeah. 1989 there. Old Batmobiles. I've got a few of these already, but that's cool to have two or three of them. Yeah, I don't I care. I'll do some trading yeah. and selling. Right. Yeah, them right there. And you say you wanted 30 on them. Yeah. What's these right here? Uh, man, oh, I just die cool. brought those in. There was two of them. I was like, man, I'll bring us a few like, scars. Yeah, nah, yeah, I like these bands, too. Yeah, man. The Bart were... Simpson one, that one's cool, too. Yeah. I've been looking for that one. Oh, really? Yeah, I good. didn't even notice that until last night when I was looking back at the pictures and stuff. That's There's really cool. There's odd things in there, man. Yeah, and these Good trucks. Stuff. I'm looking for the Mountaineer, too. What you got over there? Oh, man, just all types. Of... This is oh, the bag Lord. Of Just different stuff, but these are more like lots of... Ferraris, Corvettes, Porsches, Camaros, there's some Days of Thunder. Oh yeah, I saw them on there. I remember them. Yeah. That's pretty cool. What's it, anything Porsche. in the case or? I uh, know. It's That's just a case. case. Yeah, I got Porsche one of them like that. That's pretty cool. Pretty old. Yeah, they're all. Huh. That's cool. Yeah, what's in there? Just, just all types just of cars. Everything. Man. Different. Ones that I really didn't see any type of match or whatever. Oh, yeah. Just different. Nothing really, really old there. Some of them, a few of them look here and there. Yeah. yeah that one's a little old. That's, a, that's pretty cool. Stick to the side. I've been seeing them before. So you just sell them for somebody else, huh? Yeah. That's pretty cool. Some trucks. Uh, yeah, I'm always on the hunt for the vintage stuff. Yeah. I buy a few new things here and there at the stores and stuff, but I like the vintage stuff more than anything. Would you throw this whole bag in too with this right here? Did you add this up? 20 more bucks, I would probably throw those in. I got 125 bucks on it. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Right. Okay, we're back in the shed, and I'm not going to dump everything out in front of you, but this is the main thing that I wanted right here was these trucks, which I've already got, Mad Dog 2. So, hi to the uh, hog ones right here. This is part of the mud racers. You can tell the tires are a lot different on that. So, didn't have none of them to begin with, so we'll stick that over there because there is another one right here. But we do have Doc Crush. Uh, this is one that I've never seen out in the wild. The uh, headlights and everything is still on it really good. So, yes, definitely add to the collection. It looks really good. Doesn't really have just a few little nicks here and there, but not too bad. Something that uh, definitely was looking for. Got Flying High right here. This is another one that I didn't think I'd ever come across in the wild. Really cool to find it. Definitely adding it to the collection. Looks really good all over. He actually did have some price tags on him at one time. Looks like he wanted $4 for this one. Still not bad price. Got this one right here. This is Mudslinger 2. This is also part of the uh, mud uh, racer ones because you can tell the wheels are different on that one. So definitely have one of them. And I have the Corvette here, which I don't really know if it has a name. It doesn't show nothing on it. Would have loved to found a USA one, but still we're looking for that. But this one is a one right here. So <laughs> we'll add that to the collection. And we did find another Bigfoot, which is pretty cool. It does have some fillet bites and stuff. Nothing like mine. Mine's completely men or anything. That's still cool to find in the wild, a Bigfoot here from the 
Matchbox series back in the day. The rest of them, I'm just gonna put some notable ones up here and do it just like this right here so we won't make this video too long, so here we go. Ended up with four of these Ertl Batman cars, uh, the Batmobile from 1989. You'd have some stickers on the bottom, I'm gonna tear them off. They're played with, they just need cleaned up a little bit, but still cool to add to the collection and maybe do some customs with them one day, I don't know, but uh, I definitely didn't have any of these in the collection. Always looking for these. I can't believe I found two more of these. I just got one of these recently. This one's, you know, it's kind of beat up and stuff, but still cool to find. I'll never leave them behind the Cosmic Blues ones and the Red Rider. I think I probably got uh, five of these Red Riders now, so still cool to have. Who knows, maybe one day I'll start selling on whatnot. Would that be a hoot? I don't know. Let's uh, give me some feedback and let me know what you think. Got a few trucks that I was looking for. Well, this one, this is, a, I really wasn't looking for this one, but this one's pretty cool. It's got little flames and stuff on it. I did see this one at a con before, passed it up, and I've got a few of these different colors and stuff, so that's cool. And it has the blade on the front of it. And the Mountain Man, I've been looking for the Mountain Man one for a while. I think I said Mountaineer on there, but been looking for this one for a little while to add to the collection. Got some bands here. This one looks like an 18 band, but it's a little different than normal 18 bands. I think the actual, yeah, the, the hood opens up on this one. You can see the engine and stuff. Has uh, real rider tires on it, Hot Wheels put out. So uh, that's neat to find that one. And this Bart Simpson, well, the Simpsons ones, I should say, all together, because Bart's on this side, and um, I think Maggie is her name, yeah, on this side. So this is really neat. I just recently learned about these, and then um, decided to add it. I don't know if you look through the, maybe if you look through the back, you can see some. Yeah, I just now noticed where they had the hole there. You look through there, you can't probably see it on here. If I zoom it in, you might be able to see it a little bit, but there's a picture in there. Kind of like they did when I was a kid with some of the other cars back in the early 80s. And bands and stuff, or Marvel and stuff, used to put out where you could see stuff So on there. But that's cool. You can probably see a little bit of it right there if you zoom it in. This van has no interior at all. Maybe I'll do, I don't know what happened here. It doesn't look like nobody's done anything to it though, but maybe you can just pop it off somehow. I don't know, but I don't know, it's crazy. It didn't have nothing on there. This one right here says Stegosaurus or something like that on it. And on this side, it I thought had a scorpion on it from the picture when I was looking, but no, it's a dinosaur. So I don't know what I was thinking, but yeah, that one's a pretty neat one. More stuff from the 70s and 80s and 90s altogether. I don't know about this one. I've seen this one before. It's called the Stage Fright. Does it supposed to have a motor or something sitting up there? If not, I don't know. It might be. This is Hot Wheels, though, I believe. Yeah, it is Hot Wheels. It looks like something that Johnny Lightning would put out, though. But still, that was the one that really caught my eye right there. And uh, then you have some of these. These are almost like trackers or something. I don't know. I've never seen these. There's two of them. This one's definitely in better shape than that one. This one is really good shape. Uh, we have a Mustang here with some jacked up wheels on the back of them right there. That's pretty neat. We also have these with the boom boom in the back. I always, <laughs> I always see um, one guy's video online. He does that and he has uh, adds the bass to it and plays bass music and stuff every time he sees one of these out in public. So that's cool to have. I've had a few of these before in back in my days and I believe I might actually have a yellow one right now and I found that one. And I always uh, admired this one when I was young. I don't know why, but you can tell um, I've seen this one quite a bit over and over. Then we got some of these. This is cool. This is a, a EMS, kind of like the sheriff car that I've got. This is not real, real old. I, Got stickers on a lot of these. I guess maybe sometimes he had them on at a yard sale flea market or something. He was trying to sell them or whatever. Got that one. This one right here looks pretty neat. I've seen this one before and some people's like a little dent in the back of that one, but it's it's really out there and different. It is an older Hot Wheels. This one looks like something from the Derby, which I thought was pretty neat. Maybe do a custom on it or something one day. Maybe add some real rubber tires on that and do something with it. So uh yeah, I'm in the mood for doing some uh, uh, customs here with some of this stuff like this, too. We also got the Sunkiss ones. It's pretty cool. I think it's a Mustang, too. It's kind of a little beat up, but it's 
still cool to find. I've always seen this one. I forgot one of these two. There's two of these out here looking bright and yellow. This is really cool right here too. I like this one, a little drag strip car. And it is a Hot Wheels. And a few other ones right here. This one, I think the hood opens up on this, I believe, maybe, maybe not. Have to beat it to death to try to get it out. Another cool looking Mustang right here with some big old wheels on the back. Yeah, really neat. And uh, I don't know what this is. This one's pretty neat. It's a pace car though for Matchbox. Yeah, and some other stuff. Kind of like a Rambo looking ride here. I don't know. Doesn't have the grill on the front of it though. And I got a bunch of jive looking kind of stuff. I don't know. I'll probably end up sending to the grandbabies here. Check this thing out. I don't know <laughs> what the deal is there and stuff like this. Some of it's from the 90s. Some of it's from the uh, early 2000s. There's a mixture of everything here from 70s up to the 2000s. And uh, I'll just swing this over here like this real quick and show you a bunch of more just odds and ends of scraped up and battered and I mean added 20 more dollars on it look at this thing right here it's got a bird on it had to go to the boys some other little things I just dropped another one in the floor hard to do with a Walmart bag apparently I've been busy today it looked like somebody's already repainted this and stuck stuff on it I don't know what happened there a few other things here and there I'll end up doing having for the grandbabies but uh main thing was is some trucks in the background that i have and some doubles and everything and the batmobiles and stuff so yeah Whew. i've had a lot to do this morning i've had to run out and do stuff and um, i had to get stuff from uh for my lady and i had to uh oh, just a few other things i can't even remember what i did i was just everywhere and then all of a sudden i had to run 20 miles down the road to get this stuff so glad i did get it let me know what your favorite is. My favorites, of course, are the monster trucks. I'm sorry. I do like Matchbox monster trucks, but I do like the vans, and I like this Simpsons ride right here, and a few other things. Hot ride. Yeah, that one's pretty different because I've never seen one. That one's actually got plastic on the back and everything, so that's different. But anyway, yeah, let me know what your favorites are, and uh, I think I did good. Hopefully I did good. I, I don't think I did too bad. For the prices that I paid for everything. That's it for this video. This is Diecast Johnny reminding you to keep on collecting.